Hey, what's up, guys? Totally dubbed here. And first of all, just check out this. Two guys, three guys line up. One guy spawns and I shoot. That should have been a triple headshot, but uh, unfortunately it didn't count. But anyway, guys, um, this is my impressions, initial impressions of Battlefield 4 Beta. So I've been playing it for about seven hours now. Um, yep, that's quite a bit uh, in under just about two days. So I've been playing it quite a bit, and this is all footage with the Xbox 360. You might be saying, oh, the graphics are horrible. Well, the graphics are horrible, but the graphics are especially horrible in this video because it's me with my camera on a tripod recording my screen. So whatever you see right now is my camera uh, picking up. It's not a HD PVR, it's not a it's not anything, it's not a dazzle or whatever it is. Um, it's me with my camera. So you might be seeing sometimes you'll be like, oh, it's really blurry, but that's because it is. But gameplay is um, above um, graphics, so I just thought to share it with you. So my initial impressions right now, after playing for seven hours, is in all honesty, there's some old Battlefield feel of it. And um, by that I mean... It's more like original Battlefield titles. We're speaking uh, Battlefield 2142, uh, Battlefield 2. Um, it feels like the old ones, and that is an incredibly, incredibly good thing. It's an incredibly good feel. It's like a slower pace, I think that's why. And also the guns seem just a little bit different. But that said, um, it's, shall I say still Battlefield? Of course it's still Battlefield because that's the game. But um, in all honesty, it feels like Battlefield 3's map pack, uh, just, or I'm ge gonna guess when the final release comes out with an updated um, uh, graphics and whatnot, but um, it it just seems just a little bit, I don't know, it doesn't seem nothing new, it's nothing that great. I played 7 hours as I said, um, and I'm already bored of this map, I've just played it to death and it's just the same thing over and over again. The good thing is there's no real like spawn camping or anything like that that you notice in Battlefield 3 and there's very little bottleneck points like you have in like Metro or um, those vanilla maps on Bat Battlefield 3. So from coming from Battlefield 3 you'll definitely um, enjoy the game much more but as a Battlefield veteran myself I um, I don't know, I, it just doesn't feel that special and th there's so many problems with this beta and I know it's an old build and whatnot but come on EA, sort your crap out. There's so many problems. You can see right now I'm aiming with a tank. Those shots should have really killed the people um, but the tank aim is completely off. Where I'm shooting is not where it's hitting. Um, it's just a little bit disappointing. There's so many different little aspects of this game that are broken um, right now and this was the same with Battlefield 3 but I would have expected a little bit more from EA. Um, <laughs> that's a little funny uh, flying off shot with the sniper. But um, overall, it's definitely a worthy game to buy. But I can't really pin down spending £80 on the game. And by that, I mean buying premium and the game. Um, right now, I've got it pre ordered for £55 on PC. Um, I ha I'm not going to buy another Xbox 360 game. I'm just, I'm all gone on PC. But. £55 is decent for premium and the game, um, but I, I don't feel like paying anything more. It just doesn't feel anything special right now. I mean, from my my impression so far, doesn't feel like anything special. And I know I've been playing this on uh, uh, the Xbox, so my opinion might well change when I go to the Battlefield uh, beater when it opens up on the 4th, uh, which is tomorrow on PC. But so far... I mean, gameplay-wise, I'm not looking at graphics, I'm not looking at anything else. Gameplay-wise, it still feels like Battlefield doesn't feel like anything that special uh, to me. It doesn't feel anything new, let's put it that way. It feels like Battlefield 3 just improved upon. This is what, let's put it this way, this is what Battlefield 3 should have been initially, but it wasn't. So, it is an improvement over Battlefield 3 um, so far, uh, from my um, little experience that I've had, uh, but it's not something I would get overly excited about and say, well, this is a next-gen game, blah, 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 it's, it's going to be amazing, whatever. Yes and no. Um, there are things in there that you're going to go, why is this not like this? Or why is this not changed? Or why is this not improved? And there's other things that you say, hey, this is a nice improvement. Um, a good a good example is, one, there's le less bottlenecks with this map. And from uh, on maps I've seen, there's less bottlenecks. But um, a bad thing is, for example, all the guns are so easy to use, it feels like playing Call of Duty. Let's put it that way. 
Anyway guys, hope you enjoyed this video and do take some time to subscribe, like and comment. Take care guys, totally dubbed out, bye bye.